on this edition of the HDTV Morning Announcements. Brace yourself for a bombardment by a barrage of big, bold words and an anticlimactic absence of an assemblance of alliteration. And scholarship news, anyway, the news starts right now. Please, Dan, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Hey, guys. Smell. Well, that's Israel. Anyway, so lunch. On lines one and two, we're going to have cheeseburgers. Three, we'll have a hot dog bore. Bar. <laughs> Line four, we'll have ravioli, and line five, which is open, for once, we'll have some personal pan pizza. And a happy birthday goes out to Joanna Cruz and Emily Lopez Cardenas. Now into sports with Nick Kinder. Kinder the kind man. Thanks, guys. The softball team opened their season with an impressive win over LCC by a score of 19 to seven. Avery Drew collected the win, pitching two innings, allowing one hit, with five strikeouts. Harper pitched two innings with three strikeouts. And Whitaker led at the plate going three for three, for three followed by Roberts and Bezler, who both went two for three. The highlight of the night came from back-to-back -back home runs by Dean and Keenma. A, a congratulations goes out to Nayeli Alanis and Evan Jordan for making the indoor state meet. That's it for sports. Now on back over to the news. Thanks, Nick Dallas. The band and choir are going to Kings Island on May 11th. If you are in band-related classes this year and have not signed up to go, please see Mr. Hutton for details. Choir members, CD. I mean, it's pay, permission slip, and then wait until May. So I don't really know what else you would need to know, so. The English Scholarship is now available for students who want to learn more about a specific artistic, academic, or career-based interest this summer. If you are interested, grades 9 through 11 are interested in a $500 scholarship, stop by guidance for an application. The application is still on April the 5th. Stop by the bookstore to pick up your permission slip or slips for prom. You must turn in your slip before you can buy a ticket. Prom tickets will be sold starting on April 1st and will be only $20 during the first week after spring break. After that, they'll be bumped back up to a $25 price point. Pick up your permission slip today. The Stacey Ball Legacy Scholarship is now available. If you would like to like, uh, have an opportunity to receive the scholarship, then you must be a graduating senior with a GPA of 3.0 or higher, who has already been accepted to a secondary, secondary education institution and is going to a field of science and education. Applications are, are may, may be picked up and tuned into the guidance department and now we're due on April 4th. Mrs. Bacon and Mrs. Lovis are going to have tryouts for Sapphire Majorettes the week following spring break. There will be a call out for anyone interested on April 1st at 4 p.m. Tryouts are from 4 to 5 on April 2nd, 3rd, and 4th, and you must attend all three dates. Sapphire Majorettes is a hybrid of the fire dance team and the color guard. If there are any questions, contact Mrs. Bacon or Mrs. Lovis. That's well. it for today's morning announcements. We hope to see you on a Friday high day. Something that Mo will come up, come up on the spot. Well, yeah. Huh?